Chinese street food. All right, so welcome back, Dave Each London. We're uh, downtown London, right on Dundas Street. And we're gonna try the bun, classic Chinese street food. Sounds delicious. All right, so here we are. This is the menu. It's on a TV at the back at the counter. You order at the counter, they give you a number, you go sit down, and they bring you your food. Now, the restaurant's beautiful. They've done a great job. These live edge tables, they're wonderful. The exposed brick, it's really a nice little restaurant here. And the prices, uh, I know it was hard to see the menu, but the prices, they seem quite good too. So let's get some food ordered and we'll get right to it. So the food's on its way, we've ordered. Now we did have live audio, but the music was really loud in there, wasn't it Lucinda? Yes, it was. And we would have got a copyright strike for sure. So. That's why we're doing a voiceover. But anyways, the food's here. Let's get a picture of what Lucinda has here. Tell us what you have, Lucinda. These are uh, homemade rice noodles with uh, slivers of cucumber, and I wasn't sure what the stuff was around the outside, but uh, it had like a chili broth, chili sauce broth. It was quite good. Okay, so I had these al Alma wontons, Alamo wontons. Uh, they were in a spicy chili sauce. They, they were a pork wonton, uh, basically. Now I also got the combo, so I got one of their pork sandwiches. And it doesn't look like a lot, but wait till we take a bite. You'll see what these are all about. Now I did order an appetizer, it came with an appetizer as well. And these were supposed to be green peppers, right? Yes. They don't look like green peppers. I'm not sure what they are, let me take a bite. Yeah, that's not green pepper. Uh, well, why don't we show you here? That's a boiled egg in there, Lucinda, isn't it? Yes. Um, it's a surprise to me. It was cold. It was battered and cold. It was a little strange, but it wasn't. It was just tasted like an egg. Yes. So let me try my soup here. Uh, the wonton soup. Uh, it's full of wontons. Now this wasn't an expensive combo. Now the broth is pretty spicy. It's a uh, it's a chili paste. You asked me if I like spicy food. I said yes. Maybe I shouldn't have. It really bit me in the back of the throat, this, but uh, all in all, it was delicious. It was nice. Um, so let me take a bite of this sandwich. It's like a naan bread, and oh my God, this thing is just delicious. Uh, it's just a roasted pork. It doesn't have any sauce on it. Didn't really have much in the seasoning, but it really had that roast pork flavor. And that bread, it, I would describe it similar to a naan bread, but crispier. And, oh, it was really good. So let's let Lucinda try hers. The uh, noodles, uh, you can tell they're uh, homemade or handmade. They were very tender. Um, it was quite good. Now, I thought it was going to be hot. It actually uh, is a cold dish. But uh, I enjoyed it. It was uh, very good. I just want to say that bowl was only six bucks, wasn't it? Yes. Six dollars. And that combo I had was $15, I think, including the beverage. Um, so you're gonna try this. Yes, I, uh, I did try it. Um, it was spongy. Um, really had no flavor to it. It kind of looked like it had air pockets in it, like bread more than a tofu, but. But it wasn't mushy like a bread. It, uh, it was something we're gonna have to go as undetermined we're not exactly sure what it was, but we're going to let Lucinda try the egg. Yeah, it was an egg. Uh, maybe a little overcooked. It, had, it was quite gray around the outside of it. Um, but otherwise... It really had no flavor, that batter, though, did it? No, you no, could, it You didn't. could really just taste the egg. Not to say that was bad, just not what I really expected. We'll let her take a bite of this sandwich. Now that pork sandwich... It might have been real simple, but it was delicious. You wish but, you ordered that now, don't oh, you? Oh, I do, I do. The it just the roasted pork just was so flavorful. 
and that bread was warm and crispy on the outside. If you go here for one thing, you gotta go for that sandwich. Now, this was a, like a ladle they give you for a soup spoon. <laughs> it was a really strange thing. Not what I expected for a spoon. But anyways, there's the chili paste. That's basically what the soup is made out of. We're gonna go outside. We're gonna finish this up. We'll tell you what we think about it outside. We'll be right back. All right, so that was the bun. Classic Chinese street food restaurant. What do we think of it? I thought it was pretty good. We really didn't know what to order off the menu. Um, if I were to make some suggestions when I went in here, I would ask if the meal's hot or cold. Uh, Lucinda kind of thought her noodle dish was going to be warm, and, and it was cold when it came, but that doesn't mean it was bad. Uh, if you come down here for one thing, you got to try that pork sandwich. That thing is unbelievable. It really is. So check it out. Leave a comment below. Tell us if you've been here, what you think of this place. Uh, subscribe, and look for us next time, because I'm Dave, and this has been Dave Eats London.